Have you ever been bored in the bathroom and wondered, what did people use before toilet paper? Let's find out on today's episode of Colossal Question. Even before toilet paper was invented, people still needed to wipe themselves after going to the bathroom. And through the years, there have been all sorts of solutions to this ancient problem. The Romans used a tersorium. That's a fancy Roman name for, well, a sponge attached to the end of a stick that was shared by everyone. Yeah, not ideal. But that's not all. The stalls weren't very private. Romans had one long marble bench with several holes carved out, no walls or barriers between them. Sticks wrapped in cloth were used in parts of China as well. Around this time, paper was invented by the Chinese and eventually people started using bits of leftover paper instead. The very first known flushing toilet was invented in England in 1596, but it remained a royal luxury. And things didn't change all that much in the butt wiping department for a long time. In colonial America, British settlers colonizing North America often wiped with corn cobs before switching to old scraps of parchment. Toilet paper wasn't actually available to the masses for the first time until 1857. And even then, it wasn't quite as soft and strong as it is today. For the first few decades, people would often get little splinters from the loose, poor quality paper used at the time. In the last 50 or so years, there have been lots of innovations in toilet paper technology, leading to the ultra soft, absorbent, and strong stuff around today. So, next time your brother leaves the bathroom smelly and soiled when you gotta go, <laughs> just be glad you're not sharing a sponge on a stick. <laughs>